Hi everyone, I'm Joanne. Welcome to my craft room for the first day of Junk Journal July. And day one prompt is Spark. I don't have the paper in front of me. Anyhow, I know it's Spark because I've been thinking about it. And every time I thought about it, I thought of a sparkler. Um, and so I went on and Googled some images of sparklers and I love this and I love this. So I think of it as in spark your creativity. That's how I just interpret it. So I'm going to leave this half empty because I do want to put the prompt list there. So I'm really just working on this side. So I went through some things, um, but I have that, but it didn't really speak to what I was looking for. I, I kind of was looking for something a little more glittery, although this works. I don't know. I don't know. But we'll pull that. We'll leave that out, maybe. I don't know why I pulled out flowers, because I guess flowers spark my creativity. So what I'm going to do is, where is my glue stick? Right here. And I need some glue paper. I go through so much glue stick for these challenges, which is fine. But I also, to my right, I have a whole bin of scraps. So I just pulled a whole bunch of them out. But I thought I would just start layering and see what I come up with. And I think the little sparkler image will be the focal point. So let me put this down as kind of a line of delineation here. Wow, I can't believe it's July. Well, I can believe it, I guess. <laughs> I don't know what I believe anymore. But June went fast. I think it did. It was a hot month, right? And I think I'm just going to rip this. All right, and I'll cut off the excess. This should be pretty quick because I um I don't really have a big area that I'm working with. You know. So I'm just gonna collage and I really I'm looking forward to this project every day because I think it speaks to a lot of collaging and um I haven't been doing it a lot lately. And I mentioned in, I think, the video where I made my book that I stopped receiving um, a kit uh, um, every month, and I used to collage it every month. And since I stopped that, I haven't been doing as much collage, but hopefully this will, uh, I don't like it that it's the same height. And as much as I want to be loose, I kind of like straight lines. <laughs> um, yeah, let's just put that up there. This is like a fiber piece of um, I wouldn't even call it paper. I don't know what I want to call it. But I don't want it so straight. All right, what else did I pull out here? Pull out some of these and that. Here's a piece of map. Which I think I'll put up in this corner here. Yeah, I was looking, like, when I kept thinking of the prompt, I'm like, do I have, like, a firework stencil? And I could do, like, a gold, but I don't. Let me put another little piece of this down in here. <clears throat> Let me move around on my chair here a little. I do have this. Um... Maybe I didn't pull enough out here. I have this poem that I tried to read that was kind of cool. And I don't even care if part of it gets cut off. 
because I think a lot of it's going to get covered anyway. I may not even use it, but I do like this little piece of paper here. Put that down in there, maybe. I think I need to go that way. What else? What else? What else? I do have, I pulled out two of these out of this book I have <clears throat> because the ones I have in my bin, I feel like I used a lot in junk journal January and I really didn't want the same things. So I wanted something different. I like this and I do have more pieces of that somewhere. I have this that would tie in some of the purple. Oh, here it is. I knew I had more and I did want to use this. So let's put that up in the top. And just I'm going to rip it. wonder if everybody thought the same thing. <clears throat> like kind of a... <clears throat> excuse me. I can't talk in the morning. <laughs> I just can't. Um, meaning like a sparkler. Well, I even looked up... I do this a lot during these challenges. I looked up the definition of spark and it you know, it lent itself to like a spark in your creativity or, you know, it's something that ignites your whatever. So that's what I was thinking. But I, even though I, I thought about putting an envelope and writing about like what sparks my creativity, but I kind of just kept coming back to this image of a sparkler. In my head. So I didn't want to fight it. I wanted to go with it. I don't know if it's going to go well with this background, but we're going to see in just a minute. Here's my background for day one. I have to find the, um, it's here, but I just emptied my desk for, um, what did I make? The Academia album. I took a class, a Zoom class, so I had my desk totally cleaned off, and I kind of like it. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm going to try to leave it with a lot more space to create in. I don't think I'm going to keep this. Um, I think I'm going to rip it, but let's get the image anyway. Ooh. It looks better than I thought it was going to. Let me cut the other one out. just like that. I think that looks good. So let me just carefully rip. I can always print it again. I have a big one of it. It, it printed too big. So then I copied it smaller. So I can always go and print another one if I mess this up. If I don't like the way I ripped it. But so far, it 
I like what's going on. This is the tricky part up here. I just want to be around the edge or take off the edge. <clears throat> Again, my voice is so goopy. I actually am doing this the morning of July 1st, so. Um, hmm, I liked it more square for some reason. Let me see. Yeah, I really did. All right, I'm gonna go print another one real quickly and I'll be right back. Okay, I printed a new one and I cut it down and it's too big like that, but let me cut some more. I can always print another one. <laughs> I can just keep printing all day until I get it where I want it. I don't know why, but I, I do like it better square. Let me see if I can get my rip roller here and not destroy the image. Sometimes it's easier to rip on the bigger edge. So let's do this. Oh. I may have to just rough the edge up. Yeah, cause it's, hmm. That's my frustrated sound. It's pulling the, um, it's like almost a not, not enough to grab onto is the problem. All right, let's try the bigger side. Yeah, that's a little easier. Can always print another one. <laughs> I'll just sit here all day. The sun just went in. I hope it didn't affect your uh, your ability to see. All right, <clears throat> one more. We can do it. I really do want the thin. Ugh, why can't I get this? Had I known I was gonna rip it, I would have left more edge around it. All right, I think that's good. Hopefully this looks good. And I think it does. I like it. All right, I like it enough <laughs> to use it. I want it there or do I want it over here? Well, I think it's going here since <clears throat> that's where I ended up putting it. And then I like to write along here if I can find the letters. All right, and I like to do it on a piece of packaging so as not to totally mess it up on my book. All right, so let's see. S, is it upside down? Could be. No, it's not S. P. A. A or 
and a K right here. Spark. I'd love if I had nice like calligraphy hand uh, writing, I'd write your creativity under it, but I don't. So I won't. All right, and then I'm gonna put that right there. right there. If I put it here, maybe I can do your creativity. All right, I'm going to punch that out like a crazy person. I'll be back. Okay, I did it. So... I still think I want, look, I have ink all over me. I think I still want that there and maybe that in here. So this will be it for day one, except I do want to find that, but I can do that off camera. Spark your creativity. And I kind of want that overlapping that. Maybe more like that. There we go. Day one in the books. I like it. All right. Thank you, guys. Um, I'll see you probably tomorrow. I don't know that I'll record every single day. But I'll give it a shot for as long as I feel like you like it <laughs> all right have a great day and i will uh see you in my next video thank you for watching guys